This is National 5 exam practice homework and we're looking here at uh, paper 2000 question 20. Right, let's go ahead and look at this one. So we've got uh, remove the brackets and simplify. So I've got some indices here and I've got a fraction at the back here. So what I'd like to do with uh, this one here, I'm going to change this one into index form. So first of all, I'm just going to prepare it before I multiply it out. So there's a to the power of a half bracket a plus, and all I'm going to do is because that's a to the power of one, I'm going to take it to the top line up to the numerator and that'll be a to the minus one. What I'll then do is I'll multiply this across and remember that is an a to the power of one there. When we multiply things with indices, we add the indices together. So let's go for that. So that's going to be a to the power of a half plus one and I've got plus a to the power of a half and I'm going to be plus minus one. So I'm just going to be subtracting one away from that. And remember just the one is equal to two over two. Right, so from there what I've got is a half plus two over two would give me three over two. So a to the power of three over two plus, and that's going to be a to the power of a half minus one will give me minus a half. And that would be the question complete there. If it had asked me to, to write it with a positive index, then what I would have to do, this one would be okay for me, but this one here, I would need to take that back down to the denominator, same way as I changed this one here about, and what I'll have is one all over a to the power of a half. So for this one here, I think what we'll get is a couple of marks for it. So we'll get uh, one mark for, I would go for this line here, and I'll go for one mark for this line here, completing it. So we'll take that out of two marks. If I look down the bottom here, I've got uh, a surge question. So I'm going to express uh, root 18 minus root 2 as a surge in its simplest form. When I get a, a surge question where it's uh, adding or subtracting, there's usually a clue somewhere that can help us uh, work something out. So what I can see here is the clue that I'd be looking for is the root 2. I can't simplify that anymore, so I would expect that when I simplify this one, I'm going to get a root 2 coming out of it somehow. So 2 times 9 gives me 18. Nine's a square number, so that helps me out. So first line would be root 9 times root 2, subtracting here root 2. What I'll then do is I'll uh, take the square root of 9, which gives me a 3, root 2 minus root 2. So remember this root 2 here is 1 root 2. Okay. So I've got 3 of them here. I'm going to take one of them away, so I must be left with two of them. And what I'm working with is I'm working with root twos. So three root two take away one root two gives me two. Root two. Right, so I'm going to get uh, I'm going to go for one mark for let's go for simplifying this uh, down here to three root two, and one mark here for getting two root two as a final answer. So this one here, also out of two marks. 